Next tonight, all the coal mines have gone, but one legacy from the industry is a growing business. The Mines Rescue Service used to always be on standby should there be an explosion or fire underground. Now, the skills built up over many years have expanded to give safety training around the country. And as Tony Rowe reports, the former Nottinghamshire coalfield is at the heart of the business. Gas, gas, gas. They have the expertise in Mansfield to train businesses who have to work in confined spaces. It's expertise which goes back a long way. An urgent call for training purposes has come through. And the accident's located on the map. Special alarms warn the men wherever they may happen to be. When there was an emergency, we had a bell in the house, and when the bell rang, night or day, you had to come up to the station, get on the van and off to the colliery to the emergency. Things have changed, but today's Mines Rescue Service is still based at a 1950s building on the outskirts of Mansfield. The building has just had a complete makeover. Covid-compliant, modern classrooms, but a lot of practical training too. 19, 20, 21. Our future's bright, we're growing. We've just recently expanded our classrooms. We've, we've even employed some new staff during this pandemic. Everything's good down here, we ready to... For a lot of people, I think confined space training can be a bit of, worrying, of a worrying experience because some people are claustrophobic, etc. But actually, it's been made to be a very relaxing atmosphere, very friendly, really easy to learn. Now, if you want an example of the kind of work they do in confined spaces, then anyone who's travelled over the Clifton flyover in Nottingham recently will have been close to their work. Underneath there, there were teams working, and all the time they were there, they were being protected by our teams. Lots of physical obstructions inside that you've got to overcome. So we've got to have plans in place on how to get them out of there safely should an incident occur. They also teach people how to work at heights. Just remember, well, when you get to the top, I know you, this is new to you, mate. So just try and remember, one always above you. Well done, buddy. Falling from heights is the biggest killer at the workplace, one in four of all deaths. So one legacy of coal mining in the East Midlands is helping many businesses save lives. Tony Rowe, BBC East Midlands Today, Mansfield. Fascinating, isn't it?